I step onto the the new food trucks kitchen. So I know people think, oh, Rashad, he's just a bartender. He's just got 20 years of bartending experience. I've been in the kitchen longer than I've been behind the bar. I grew up in the kitchen. Both my parents cooked, both my dad and my mom. So I got to see um, completely different styles. Both of them were believed in very independent children as well too. So uh, I've been in behind the stove. I was a latchkey kid too. So I yeah, I've been preparing and cooking my own food probably since first grade, probably. Now, not all of that is as complicated as some of the stuff we do now, but I gotta be honest with you, <clears throat> a lot of the stuff we do now isn't much more complicated than the meals that I made at home when I got home from school, you know, D to be honest with you. Um, burgers aren't like the most complicated thing in the world to make. <laughs> I think the most complicated thing on our full menu might be um, we make a fettuccine alfredo. That might be the most complicated thing, but considering how that is one of my kids' favorite dish, and I've probably made alfredo a thousand times, <laughs> then there's really nothing too complicated on our, on our menu. A lot of fried food, uh, simple griddle food, salads. Um, yeah, breakfast might be the most complicated thing, I guess. If, if you could call it that. My sunny eggs are pretty good. My over easy, yeah, actually. So yeah, I can't really call anything on our menu too complicated. So um, it, it works out if I gotta be back there. Nothing that can't be executed.
Now I'm on line. I wasn't trying to be doing this shit all day, but got tacos to sell for some. What you gonna do? Holy shit. All right. Well, I wasn't, uh, yeah, I wasn't, I wasn't ready for all that. Uh, we got the tacos set up. I uh, had about 45, 50 pounds of meat. We're pretty much sold out. Uh, sold out of chicken completely. Got a little bit of corned beef left, um, but that works out great because we'll run it as a hash special in the morning um, uh, and get rid of that last little bit of hash. Um, and then also, um, it's just yeah busy busy tuesday night i it's nine nine o'clock now um so i stayed and uh played kitchen guy um from uh four until now uh not exactly what i had planned on my day-to-day -day. uh <laughs> there's a ton of other stuff that kind of needs my attention but uh you have to handle what's right in front of you sometimes too so um I had to sell tacos and that we did so mission accomplished i'm gonna get the hell out of here clean everything up uh and get home and get relaxed but i just wanted to put a, a, a you know period on the end of the day long day another long day um expecting another long day tomorrow as well too but i have a daytime and a nighttime cook and it looks like fingers crossed i'm gonna have both of my bartenders for nighttime and uh, daytime so who knows, maybe a whole day where I'm staffed fully and I can, I don't, I don't have to be, uh, I don't have to leave the office. <laughs> 